more. Let's do this one more time. <laughs> Franklin Kristoff. I do like his tens because they're Joe Wo Nelson or Joe Woe six. I always check because he does two fives too. Um, this is his music nib. There is a trick to it. Lay your nib flat. Otherwise, you'll have problems. Just a little bit of coasting, you know. I just don't, I don't worry about it. Oh, I got that arrow. And this is Franklin. And that is a dot com, just, that's easy. I, I get in that because I do it all the time. This is Monte. See, it's not straight. And I'll give you a close up in a minute. I do believe I have another one on this that I just thought they'd more fun to also include this. Oh, it's a strawberry. Can't take me any place. Short. And you can tell I'm writing too quick, see? Not flat. Flat. What's flat? Not flat. Not flat. So it's not the pen's fault. It's the writer's fault. <laughs> I'm gonna give you a close up. Pretty cool, huh? I, I'd, I've had it a long time, and can I be embarrassed and say, gee golly whiz, I didn't use it for a long time. Okay, here is the extra fine WA from, and I'll write it down. Oh, I didn't write it down there. You know, I know who it is. It's FP. FountainPenFPNips.com. He's in Spain, but he sends it express. I know they asked him what it meant, the WA. I probably should, huh? On this, of course, the Daisy came from Franklin Kustoff. There again, like any of them, make sure you're getting the right ones. Sorry, hopefully. And the pen is, might look purple, and a lot of people say it's pur purple. It is not. It is a pink. You guys should know me by now. Dining. No, no else does the Ashina. Oh, let me do. It's a nice smooth one. Don't let that get a close up. It's supposed to be a sheening ink. I find this is a little too fine for it to do a lot of sheen. It's okay. It's still a pretty color. Get the feather. This next one. I'm gonna write it, write it down. So. I'm going to slaughter it. I'm terrible at that stuff. Um, one of my, actually they're all my favorite. But I do believe I started buying from him, other than Franklin Kristoff, um, Pen Sloth, which I'll write it all down. This is a three, some, can you guys see that? Three, three nibs and one. Look at that. Look how gorgeous that is. Um, Pen Sloth. On IG, mm -hmm. Instagram, for those of you who don't know, because I get it. Another Woodshed Pinco, and this is Troublemaker. Cox Club. Let's get another peek at the pen. The nib. So yeah, so when I um, buy pens, unless there's certain ones, that I try to get ones, well no, I do, get them with Joe 06, because I can see, I'm not gonna, some pen slot. And this one, oh, another one. I love this bed. I think this was the first one I bought them. 
near the near the I like the tent too. Look at that. Do you wanna look cool? Look at that. Okay. I had to do it with sideways. Look at the difference. I wanted to be transparent, but I, I, that's, that's okay. Oh, I love this tin. Ever since I've had it, it's staying in my rotation. You know, some tins are just on your rotation. So this goes like this. There's wheel press. So, oh. Close enough, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Uh, this is and it could go like this. This here is all me, not not the pen, not the, not the pen, not the ink. It's me trying to hurry. Oh, let's show you one more time the warbler. Oh, I love this thing. This one's the first time it's been out of rotation was in um, January. Oh, it's a two. You can see there's two nids there soldered together. Ten sloth on Instagram. It's really nice. He, he can ask questions. He'll answer. And um, he's actually talked me out of a couple nids saying, no, Jane, it's not good because you're right-handed. I like that. And they all have. They, all these people have been very nice. The ones I wouldn't be showing them. But look at the um, shading. Oh, I just love shading. It's one of my favorites besides shading. All right. I know I'm not going to say this one. And I don't even have him down. Oh. Oh, I don't have him down. All right. Okay, this is the Conquer by... Toronto Tin Company. You just wait till you see this one. There again, another one. Whoa, you're going to where's the top of the nib? There it is. There it is. Um, this is. And this is Walton Craftworks. This is Golden Avenue only. Isn't that gorgeous? I just like this. And this is K. Yes, I'm looking to see where it's. Oh, I do have the other one on there. Oh, Carisha. Out of India, I love their inks. Wait till you see the shin. Oh, let me do the nib one more time. Gorgeous! Look at that sheen. I love sheen. Their inks are wonderful. I have two, and every time I go to pick up another one, they're always sold out. Let me go back to this one. We do have it written down. These are real flowers. You can see real flowers, and there's a few places there. You get a little texture. Oh, these are real pine cones on the end. Sterling silver flower. On um, this, when it's done in the clear, is and he just changed it up on me. It was in a box, and I said, oh, I'd like it clear. I like the Joe Wall six. And he says, All right, I can do that. I cannot say, say, well, let me do the zoom. It's a zoom nib by fpnibs.com. And um, this is Sindri Workshop, but in the UK. So really cute. I'm not really. 
Let me tell you, the packaging was gorgeous. I kept most of it. You know, sometimes they're in little boxes. And I get, no, I, I get it. I toss those because, honey. Cat. Aunt. Dawn. This one's new in my rotation, too. I love this pen. It's just a happy pen. It's parts I love demonstrators. Partially demonstrators. So we'll go on to the last one. I know it's running a lot. Oh, it's 10 minutes in. Um, this is, this was meant to be taken out. And I'm going to go for another one, but I forgot to change the nib. So it's all Jane. This is Kiss E Key. The pen slot number two, because it's only a double. You see the two? And I'll write it down so you can see. And it's not the pen, it's just my angle. So you can hear this. If you can hear it, nothing. Nothing. And this too is by Taylor. Huh. Taylor Tinko. RG. It's and then they have you if they have a the website, they'll link it to you. This is Pilot. I'm not going to try and say it. I actually got this in Japan when I was there eight, well, I think that many times, but eight years ago, I saw the, I saw the inks and I said, oh, I got to do it. Let's take another look real quick. I do love these. And let's take a look. There we go. I don't think I showed you a couple. So yeah, I mean, it's just some fun nits. I thought I'd do a, write, writing, a true writing sample. And yes, I do have the cheat sheet. Otherwise, you wouldn't know what they were and I'd make y'all confused. Um, I can highly recommend all these vendors. I, I buy, um, nothing's given to me, um, which makes it nice and easy. Is it not gonna be truthful? I am truthful. I guarantee I would not recommend something that I don't believe in. If I did get paid when I don't, but I still wouldn't. I tell them. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.